Hey folks, I just hope you can bear with me for a short while and put up with a little bit of waffling that um, I'm about to do. Um, what I'm trying to do with these, um, the, the, the lights and the reviews, as you can see my video editing skills are pretty crap. Uh, but what I'm trying to do is, is take these lights out and show you all um, you know what, what they can do when they're actually being used. Uh, and have somebody talk about them, explain them to you, who also uses them as well. Uh, I watched too many reviews, and I think you've just taken that out of the box. You've probably turned it on a couple of times in the back garden, and clearly you haven't used it because you haven't spotted something. You know, either it's runtime or it gets hot quickly or, or, or whatever. Um, so, that, so that's that's what I'm trying to do. But the the bit that's really frustrated me, and this is what I wanted to explain to you, is that over in the UK. To, to get a decent night where I can go out um, and take decent footage. They're few and far between. It's either raining or it's foggy or, or it's too blooming windy. So sort of, you know, one night out of seven, I might stand a chance of getting some footage used. I don't mind about that particularly because the, the other six nights um, is when I'm walking around and just getting used to them. Um, but I really got bugged on the last um, few videos that I'd done. You probably could see that I'd done the desktop reviews over the, over the course of several nights and then took them all out, uh, four or five of them, I think it was, and did the, uh, the, the the footage. And I got in, and the wind, and I was like, oh, God, you know, the, the wind, the rain, God knows what. Um, if I wait for perfect conditions, I'd never do a video at all. But then I look back at them and I think, oh, that's a bit crap, really, you know. Um, so I'm hoping you guys can understand that I just can't get it perfect. Uh, I'll keep on trying though, um, and let me show you what I found. Look at these cameras here, these little blooming things here. Those are your, um, those are your mics. So of course, when I'm trying to talk and the, the wind's blowing over, and it just, it just buggered it all up. Um, so I brought these little things here that, uh, that hopefully I can just kind of bodge over the top and uh, make the next videos better and i have tried those and strangely you know they actually work um and i was half tempted whether to start taking some videos down particularly those i did the other night um and start putting them back up but then i'm, I'm back to the problem then that i'm not going to get uh you know repeated nights if i knew the weather was going to be you know clear and good for filming for the next week then yeah i, I think i will probably do it uh but i can't guarantee that so i'm i'm just gonna have to leave them but I just wanted to know that I was I was pretty unhappy with them. Um, and I'm doing my best to put them right and get them a little bit better moving forward. In particular, that blasted wind noise. Okay, folks, thanks for bearing with me and listening to me waffling on. And as you can see, I've got loads and loads to show you yet. In fact, so let me just give you a quick sneak preview of this little thing here that I've had. Um, let me show you this. Hopefully not make you the video a complete waste of time while I just reassemble it. I've had this on test just while I've been uh, talking to you chaps. So Lumen Top GT Nano. Look at that. Been using this now for about three nights. Um, and that's the other problem, is it? I've got so many more to, to, to do and show you. So... Thanks for your patience, folk, and do please bear with me with that. Thanks very much.